the solidarity envisioned in the United Nations Charter is being devoured by the acids of nationalism and self-interest, by a shocking disregard for the poorest and most vulnerable in our world, by politicians who play to people's worst instincts for partisan gain, by prejudice, discrimination, misinformation, and hate speech that pit people against one another, and by a global financial system that penalizes those with the least, by fossil fuel corporations killing the planet to rake in the most. My speech to the General Assembly will address these issues with concrete recommendations and a call to action. As fractures deepen and trust evaporates, we need to come together around solutions. Solutions like those that will be showcased at the Transforming Education Summit. People need to see results in their everyday lives or they will lose face in their governments and institutions and they will lose hope in the future. And so this year's general debate must be about providing hope and overcoming the divisions that are dramatically impacting in the world. That hope can indeed only come through the dialogue and the debate that are the beating heart of the United Nations and that must prevail next week against all divisions.